While the design of the manifold and preland can even out much of the flow rate differences in a die, additional control adjustments are often needed to produce sheet of uniform thickness. Control adjustments are made by the use of restrictor bars and adjustable die lips or both. These adjustments work by changing the height or thickness of the flow passage. Remember from our explanation of the Poiseuille fluid flow law that changing the height of the flow passage has an effect on flow to the third power. This effect will be the greatest when the height of the passage is smallest, as in dyes producing thin sheet. For thick sheet, the restrictor bar adjustment is used to make major changes in the flow rate inside the die. Adjustment bolts on the restrictor bar allow flow passage height to be changed in specific areas across the die. For example, closing the restrictor bar in the center will reduce the passageway thickness and decrease flow rate. Flow is diverted to where there is less resistance away from the center. Restrictor bar adjustments do not provide as fine a flow adjustment as the flexible lip. The restrictor bar is stiffer than a flexible lip and the adjustment bolts are heavier and placed farther apart, typically three inches on center. 